cars, these guys, all foot powered. Invented by Elon Tusk. We can fire medalists back then. Fast and Furious vehicles, Hobbs and Shaw again comes out this summer. If you guys keep giving us a billion dollars every time we make one of these, we're gonna keep making them. Just a heads up. Check out the Jurassic World gyrosphere. Look, Ma, no glass. Glass reflects the camera, folks. That's no fun. So they added the glass digitally for the gyrosphere. That way it wouldn't do that. Transformers vehicles, and that's not even a universal franchise. Thanks, Paramount. We work with them all the time, you guys. Paramount, Warner Brothers, Disney. We're going to mention filmography from all their movies throughout the tour today. Yeah, they've even got a ride in their park, uh, in our park. You know, Transformers ride. What about uh, that Harry Potter stuff? Thanks, Warner Brothers. That's working out real well, oh yeah. And uh, we work with non-entertainment companies too, you guys, like Mercedes. See the Mercedes on the right? They helped us out in the second Jurassic Park movie, Lost World Jurassic Park. Yeah, it's called Product Placement. You wonder why Mark Rita Bills up in the, uh, the city walk? They were featured in the new Jurassic World. Yeah. E.T. is a great example of product placement. Anyone know what E.T. was peddling in the E.T. movie? The little candy that Ellie would leave out. Reese's Pieces, that's right. Sales went up 60% within two weeks of E.T. in theaters. That's right. That's why there's still product placement, folks. That and the fact that you're fast forwarding through all your uh, trailers these days. All right, folks. We're back in a classic Universal location. Most of you should know where we are, but in case you don't... Welcome to Jurassic Park. You're surrounded by set pieces, vehicles, and props of the Jurassic Park franchise, including the mobile lab on your left-hand side. It was featured in the Lost World Jurassic Park. It's mostly plywood, painted to look like real metal, much like the cages that we see out here. Uh-oh, uh-oh, we got dinosaurs! Watch out for the Spinosaurus, okay? I'm nervous about him. He's staying very still. Maybe he just saw a T-Rex, I don't know. These big trees on the left-hand side. Notice we only build what the camera needs to see. They're just about as tall as the tram, that's it. Could put him anywhere on the back lot. It starts to look more like Jurassic Park. You know how